From the main road between Rustenburg and Sun City, this is just another lodge. But like the elephant at the entrance, the memories and the roots have never been forgotten. This place reflects a history from the early 1800s, including those of the British, Afrikaners, Indians and Africans. Now another icon of our history is standing tall 100 years after he left South Africa. This is a very significant day because the contribution of Mahatma Gandhi and the countless Indians who uh, fought in the Boer War and served a humanitarian cause in the Ambulance Corps is being recognized today. Uh, this contribution has largely been forgotten, but today through this statue it is being remembered again. This unveiling is part of the 100-year anniversary of the return of Gandhi from South Africa to India. This understates the service and sacrifice of Gandhi, the Indian Army, and the Natal Indians in the South African Anglo Boer War. Wonderful occasion, great honor for India and South Africa. The message of Mahatma Gandhi was all about coexistence, non violence, and peace. There is hope in that for India, for South Africa, and perhaps for the rest of the world. The Kira Heritage Site is also home to some of the known icons of our history. We have, of course, unveiled a statue to uh, Field Marshal Smuts and to Cecil John Rhodes and Kruger and uh, Horsi Mahatla. Um, uh, we've done one for the women in the Boer War and uh, we're looking forward to the future. We're, we're having a look to see who else we can uh, put back in the Hall of Champions. This year also marked the third year of the Paul Kruger History Festival. The festival showcases the history and heritage of the Afrikaners and the British from time immemorial. The area here is known as Fontein, and that is, was the, the country house of uh, President Paul Kruger of the Transvaal Republic just before the, the Second Boer War. Those participating in the event believe South Africa can be even a better country and forward-moving world if South Africans embrace each other's culture. These include the teachings of our forefathers like Mandela, Gandhi and many others. We hope that we can show people that it might have happened a hundred years ago, but um, it's still important for us today for them to um, see exactly what happened and where they are coming from. After the final gunshot, little ones hurried to pick up yet another piece of their history, which they will carry in their memories for many more years to come. Gabriel Monope, SABC News, Kida Heritage Site, Rustenberg.